is it going everybody? My name is Robert Baker. Welcome to GuitarControl.com and man I got three easy blues licks for you. Like I said these are simple licks that are just super easy to play uh, but sometimes it's these little things man when you play and they just add so much style to your playing. So um, that's kind of what blues is about. It's about the style not about the crazy crazy licks going all over the place but other than that, now if you want tabs for this, you can grab those down below in the description. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. There's all kinds of videos uh, from myself and all the other awesome instructors here on Guitar Control coming at you. And we're going to go ahead and get started. Like number one, we are working out of our E minor pentatonic scale, the ultimate guitar key. That or A, whichever one. Uh, we're just going to be going like this. So what I'm doing here is I play 17 on the B, which is our root note. And I roll my finger down to 17 on the high and I bend it up. Twice, and then I go back to that 15. On the high 8, then I go 17 on the B. Okay, then I'm going to grab 16 on the G. And then 15, 17 on the B. And that's it, so... Now, uh, that's out of E minor. Now, this is a very easy one to move around. All these are actually extremely easy. So basically, we're working out of box number two of our E minor pentatonic scale. If you don't know box number two, it would look like this. It would go 15, 17, 14, 17 on the A, 14, 17 on the D, 14, 16 on the G, 15, 17 on the B, 15, 17 on the high E. So we have that, you know, kind of working for us now. Like I said, so anywhere you know box two, I can move it to A real easy. I can move it to the key of uh, D. Depending on, you know, what you're playing over. So that is lick number one. Alright, so look number two is a real common kind of blues kickoff and you know blues deluxe and all that stuff. And we're gonna be utilizing our flat five, that blue note, but it comes across in a very major kind of way. So what we're doing is this. And I'm just simply playing uh, 15 to 16 on the G, then I go 15 to 17 on the B, and then 15 on the high. Super easy. So that is example number two. And all you have to do is just walking up real slow. 15, 16, uh, yeah, 15, 16 on the G. And then I go 15, 17 on the B. And then 50 on the high. Bum, bum. So it's like that, um, like I said, it's, it's E minor pentatonic, but also it's more like a G major, which is the same thing. Uh, but it's all kind of right there. All depends on the chords that are behind it. Alright, and the final one, we figured it's still easy, but we're going to spice it up a little bit. We're going to be rocking like this now. We're going to go... So what I'm doing is I'm bidding 14 up on the G of full step, then I go 12 on the B in high, then I'm going to bend 15 up on the B, and then 12 on the high E and B, then bend seven, uh, 15 on the high, so we have bending 17, then back to 12, 12, and then I go to 15 again on the B, and uh, this one with all these bends it's kind of cool because it's, it's really linking box 1 of our pentatonic scale and box two together because I mean we're bending up from a, a shared note between box one and two up to a note that's only in box two so you have you're going basically that that would be lick number three all right, well, that's going to wrap it up for us here today. Hope you enjoyed those three blues licks. You'll be rocking out with those. 
And other than that, get those tabs, subscribe, and I'll see you later.